Looking back, we can't say with certainty, with certainty, only if we had done this, this would have never happened. There isn't just one thing that would have prevented the Tucson shooting from being written into the history books. Gabby is one of roughly 100,000 victims of gun violence in America each and every year. Behind every victim lays a matrix of failure and, inadequ in, and inadequacy in our families, in our communities, in our values, in our society's approach to poverty, violence, and mental illness, and yes, also in our politics and in our gun laws. One of our messages is simple. The breadth and complexity of gun violence is great, but it is not an excuse for inaction. There's another side to our story. Gabby is a gun owner, and I'm a gun owner. We have our firearms for the same reasons that millions of Americans just like us have guns, to defend ourselves, to defend our families, for hunting, and for target shooting. We believe wholly and completely in the Second Amendment and that it confers upon all Americans the right to own a firearm for protection, collection, and recreation. We take that right very seriously, and we would never ever give it up, just like Gabby would never relinquish her gun, and I would never relinquish mine. But rights demand responsibility, and this right does not extend to terrorists, it does not extend to criminals, and it does not extend to the mentally ill. When dangerous people get guns, we are all vulnerable. At the movies, at church, conducting our everyday business, meeting with a government official. And time after time after time, at school, on our campuses, and in our children's classrooms. When dangerous people get dangerous guns, we are all the more vulnerable. Dangerous people with weapons specifically designed to inflict maximum lethality upon others have turned every single corner of our society into places of carnage and gross human loss. Our rights are paramount, but our responsibilities are serious. And as a nation, we are not taking responsibility for the gun rights that our founding fathers have conferred upon us.